Like any United Nations um, declared day, it's an opportunity to commemorate the day, to remember the target group that are being um, commemorated on that day. So 23rd of June is International Widows Day. The first International Widows Day was in um, 2011. So it's an opportunity to remember widows who are widows of violent conflict, to remember widows who are widows, for example, of HIV and AIDS, widows of a, you know, an emerging um, health situation, widows of Ebola, an opportunity to remember child widows. Now, usually when I say that, people are surprised, and I remind them that a child is anybody below the age of 18. And if sadly, for any reason whatsoever, that child has been married below the age of 18 and an unfortunate incident happens where she loses her husband, you then have a child widow. So for any woman that has lost her husband who desperately needs comfort and sometimes either due to cultural reasons or other reasons may go through harmful traditional practices. This is a day to say we want to bring an end to this. This is a special day dedicated to recognize them, to know that they are there, to know that Nigerians should sympathize with them, to also support them in their cause, and also to say that it's actually not a day that should be attributed to a negative situation, rather that anybody, every Nigeria, every woman in Nigeria can be in that kind of situation. So it's to support their cause and also to recognize their, their plight. Well, I think the, the importance of this day um, is, 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 is a day when we bring to the fore issues as they, regard, as, as they relate to um, widows and their plight and the fact that we need to be, as a society, a bit more sensitive to, the, to that plight. But I think more importantly, part of what we're talking about here today is the issue of um, being sensitive to um, gender communication. So how do we tackle the issue of, uh, um, as media that is, how do we tackle the issues that they, as they relate to uh, widowhood? In our country here, widowhood practices still exist, but we are happy that the Violence Against Persons Prohibition Act includes widowhood practices as one of the issues that we must take up. So it is an important time to look at the widows, their welfare, the children they look after, how are they coping with life in their communities? Do they receive the sort of support they need? This is the time to reflect on their plight. Remember our widows, at least, um, and look at the hardship they go through. We commemorate it so that we'll be able to see areas where we can assist instead of uh, forgetting about them because they have lost their husbands, especially the ones that are at the grassroots that are not empowered. They are not doing anything. But through the International Widows Days, there could be sensitizations, make them aware that there are places they can go and seek for help. They will be able to go and seek for skills acquisition. They could be empowered so that they will be able to look after the children.